everybody to Farming Simulator 17 here on No Creek Farms, episode 17. Woohoo! How y'all doing today, folks? Huh. I'm 70,000 in a hole. It's 2243, which is, uh, I don't know, what is that? 10, 10 o'clock? 1043. So I've been putting some hires in, folks, and I'm standing out here in the middle of the pond. So, uh, let's, let me get myself back down to earth here. Uh, as you can see, we're doing more, more mowing. Uh, we're going to start out with showing y'all the, I'm showing you the cows. Still got 10, 87% health. Uh, liquid manure and manure is getting on up there, folks. Almost at 20,000, so 20,000 liters. Uh, milk tank is 3,743, and looks like we're doing pretty good on food right now. 45,000 in a hole, and, um, well, besides the 70. Um, nothing to go there, and everything purple has been harvested, folks. And I did not do this, but <laughs> check it out. It kind of looks like a bear's face in a way, like maybe a balloon or something. And there's a string but anyway this is a, a road that goes to here this creek and there's a walking bridge and a spot we can kind of drive around when it's water's low but this is the road that I'm working on and you can see right here I guess that's where I made it concrete or not concrete but put gravel down it kind of made that ridge line there but it's going to go all the way on across here and go across here and uh that way we can access our grass fields here but uh i got this right here to do all this in here and this little spot right here the rest of this is trees right here folks and these are trees i can't get to that but we still got some fields here yeah we, we got quite a bit right here to mow but it won't take long with the big M. Um, I probably ain't gonna do too much of this. Uh, uh, it's getting kind of hard to see and keep up with the bales. If anything, I'm gonna do it with the big M. As a matter of fact, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Just park this baler and just use the big M because it, it's height down through here but it just I don't know I might do some but we'll finish it off at the beginning but y'all probably won't see that I'll do it off screen but it is just hard to track I know I don't want to do it I'm biased with the fields I can look like right here in the beginning Put all of them in order so I can see. Oh, oh. So that's how y'all treat my vehicles. Who are we? We got Donna and Chad. my truck doing way over there oh okay it, it's it's time to stop my driver is trying to go off the edge of the map Actually, 
Yeah, folks, I'm going to go ahead and uh, pause the video here. this for a little bit. I gotta go talk to my mom anyway. She's the next one. Holla. So I gotta go see what she wants. Uh oh. That was my alarm clock. I forgot I had it set for 10 o'clock. But anyway folks, um, I will be right back when it's daylight. Okay? Be the next day. Not not next day to y'all, but the next day on the video. So I'll be just don't go nowhere. Right back. All right, folks. Take a look at this. This this is this uh. It is a nightmare. All right, we got eight solid rows here, which is 384 fails. Uh, there's nine rows. Uh, but minus five. There's three here. And there and that total is 427 bales 427 bales folks what, wow I'll find out let me go down to the ground here bump my speed up we actually you can see that I'm over the power line right right about the Watch the power line. It glitches through. So I don't have to worry about the power lines. I don't have to worry about the power lines. Now I know it's unrealistic that this truck can pull this many bales. But like I said before, this is just for fun. Just for fun. Bales. But just to think, this is 427 bales. This thing holds 600. Okay? Now, do y'all want to see 600 bales on it? I do. We're so close. But, uh, you know, I worked to, uh, I think 11.40. Almost midnight last night. And let me show you how much fuel is on, in this thing. I don't use that much fuel, folks. Just mowing the first season. Or the first cut. So uh, we gotta get some fuel. Let me move this another out of the way. Also been pressure washing them. Uh, kind of got the tires dirty again. Didn't get them too good. But uh, yeah, we're fixing to go cut some more. Uh, don't worry, y'all won't see all of it. Uh, go ahead and get that on there. And looks like we got Max Sand. Yep, we got Max Sand waiting. Go ahead and get the big chrome big M and uh, ah, there we go. I got on that side. Hey, folks, these monitors actually work, so I did not know that. Watch this. Oh, wrong one. Huh. Start it back up here. Gosh, it's dirty. Oh, first I need to Okay, right, well, uh, yeah, we'll show that later. But I did not use this setup in front of me last time. I don't want to put too much fuel on this. Uh, let it go back here in a little bit. So I'm thinking about 250 gallons. Oops. Shut it off right now. We're gonna wash this baby up. I'm on a clean girl. Wash you up. Wash you up. And the baler behind this thing is ours. They were over there on that track. I should get them switched out. I 
can't see him moving all them still doing good old bird. Hey man, because I'm mowing the grass. Uh, let's see here. Not gonna worry about the truck. We'll watch it later. Let's see. Get that back in auto load. Get that back in auto load. And then we're going to hook up to that. And we're gonna get this one to follow the other one. Jesse and Sarah looks like this front raised up. What's up? This looks like it's loaded for a I guess all that weight. All right. Well, anyway, we are going to go down to the very far pasture and work back this way. For those that wants to see this, I'm sorry, but I'm trying to keep this video short. I've been six minutes on my first one, and it's gonna be six minutes on this one, and then we're gonna go to another clip here in a second. What y'all think about the road, folks? I I'll stay long enough where y'all can see the road. I can stay on it. Trying to keep it smooth so you no know, jerks and stuff in there and lots of turning. That way everybody can keep up. You forgetting anybody? No, nope, no, nope, everybody's there. Uh, you know, Jesse, Sarah, and Max Sam. And I got it to come right here and I uh, got it to curve back this way. Down this little slope right here. And we got this little piece here we're going on. Or mow it with a big M. I like mowing with a big M because it's less messy. Alrighty. Ow! Hey, Max saying that hurts. Alright, so I have to unfold every time. air conditioner. Oh, you're smoking hot. Anyway, anyway, folks, we got that going. This one's a little bit more trickier. your wheels on the throne. Oh, I do this time. I ran this 10.5 to the left. We'll see what that does. I'm going to pull up a little bit of the front.
right there on the dark, on the shore part where I turned down, it takes some fertilization away. That's why I didn't want to turn it on. Next year, or next time we do this, we might get two diggings. Might be a whole lot easier. I wish we could do that one, but I have to take it out of the game every time. Uh, save it, because when I go back to load it, I don't want to hire. those bales enough to, to reach the 600 that way we can see what it looks like full so let me finish this and I'll be right back and I'll clean my eye okay all right all right that's uh that is close we're gonna get that bale we're gonna let this uh Then we're going to get this note here. And folks, we almost got a full load here. Which I done went and filled up some. Now see how this one shows the... We uh, done 565 this time around. 857 all together on this one. So, uh... But the reason why I'm doing this instead of showing y'all the other thing is I'm still going to do that. I'm going to this part right here. That's a nice update right there. Okay, let's shift that motor on. Let's see. That one's off. That one's off. And this one's out of fuel. It's out of fuel. So we're going to return it to Senda. We're down to 118. sound. Get in it, quits doing it. But way it looks, we need two, four, six, seven bales. So, uh, we're going to get this right here. We're going to do the same bales, then we're going to go and look at the, uh, that big old trailer. But first, let me go in the shop here. To the garage. Let's go to it. And, oh, I still got the roller released. Oh, we got to hurry up and get that done. All right, here we go. We're going to hit it big one first. Um, I hate to see it go, but we put 7.3 hours on it. Ooh. Uh, yes, return, please. Um, John, also come get our baler. We put 4.7 hours on it. And let's hope I got the right one. All right, we're going to get rid of that roller pretty soon. Uh, back to shop. Actually, let's fix that. Wow, they come and get that stuff quick, folks. I'm going to go ahead and open this gate up while I'm out. I had to close it so I can come through here. Ah, ha, 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 okay. Start her up, turn her on, go left, alright, and hit shift. 
shift that behind is the cake. We need two, four, six, seven bells. Okay. Not a biggie. Not a biggie. Alright. And now what I've been doing, I made a cross the hand several times. Cross the hand down there several times. Oh my god, I'm doing sick. The course play, uh, not course play, but the uh, GPS from that big gun. It only looked like a gun. Uh, yeah, I can't mow the whole thing, but I haven't. It's, there, there we go. And I'm going to start another course over. So. Uh, GPS, let's rotate you. Just a little bit, folks. Now, I had it something about like that. I'm gonna uh, just kind of go like that right there, make it work. And uh, just throw my ears up. Alright, there we go. We got seven bells to make. Uh, so, I think we're about 13 minutes in, give or take. That's why I hate doing cut screens, because you lose track of the time. I know I had six minutes the first time, and six and a half to a second, maybe. Well, we're doing pretty good, folks. That's, that's a lot of bales. That is extremely a lot of bales we got. Like I said, I want to see that other thing pull. And, um, I don't know if uh, we got it completely full or not. Okay, that turned out perfect. But you can see how many ends, rounds on the ends I did. Okay, I'm going to go back to here. And hit our code W. And back to more we go. I don't see no bells laying anywhere, so... Hopefully we got them all. I've been doing uh, pretty good about picking them up as we go. Uh, also got around the pond air mode. It shouldn't be too much longer. And uh, like I said, since we get that trailer there full, we're going to take it to the shop. And then we're going to haul that thing off and it's going to be payday. at five. So five more bales. I gotta speed that wrapper back up on that bale. I forgot I re-downloaded it because I made a boo-boo on the pickup part of it. I was trying to make it wider. And, uh, just didn't work like I wanted it to. I hit all the width and done the rake instead of the more. The more is uh, 8.2, I believe. 
just go from there. It won't be that much of a beat. The next time I get a hit real quick. On, uh, there's one thing about that Baylor when it uh, does 18 mile an hour and you're doing 13. It has a tendency to catch up until it does that right there. That's just when it's spinning. So if it could spin faster, it could probably stay up with us. But uh, since uh, it's back here a little ways, we get right here. And uh, we'll look at our map. And that, folks, is pretty much it. I got one more field right up in here to do. But uh, we get this field and uh, do this field. And that'd be it. Or else that'd be trees. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Are we full? Now right, we hold three more. What it? Oh, right here it goes. I gotta get them as we go, cause if not, I'll forget about them, folks. Alright, two bells left. Maybe one more bell, cause there's that. Maybe I'll pick it up. Alright. Now I just hope our path right here is not off too much. Just a little bit is what she said. Oh well, gotta straighten her up. Maybe it'll be enough to get that one last bail. Speaking of, did he pick it up? Looked like he did. So one bail left. The truck will be full. Now folks, look at tomorrow. That's right, tomorrow is the first day of summer. We're still, you know, we're waiting on our crops to grow, so as soon as I get all this mowed, I'll start fast forward time again until it's time to put the grass in. And I have to do grass cutting all over again. So it, it kind of wears you out there in the grass cutting. But I'm going to, you know, I said this once before. We should be full now, folks. Especially, yep, right there. I don't know why it hops out when I show it off. Go ahead and shut this one off. Oh, we gotta unhire. Who do we have anyway? Uh, we got Donna and Jennifer. Okay, Donna and Jennifer. So, what are yours? Shut that now. Be higher, and we're gonna grab our last bail here. There we go. We got a full load, folks. What do y'all think about that? I thought about adding another trailer, but I don't know if this truck will be able to pull it. I really don't. It'd be sluggish. But then again, we got 11 point something hour hours on this truck without a maintenance. Uh, so we need to start repairing some vehicles. But we've been waiting for this big payday. I love that downshift. I love that sound, I really do. I don't know why, but if it's tuned right, 
Sound like it's the motor trying to race over the brake. So. All right, here's our big stockpile. Oh man, it's a bit too much All right, let's watch this. Uh, oops. Uh, why? Bam! Even taller. Okay. So we're going to load back and then go to the next trailer. And try to get it where we can see it good. How about that? Mm. Bam! Even more taller. Now, folks, that thing still ain't full. I thought I would have enough to fill it by now. Let's see here. I don't know if I can count them. One, two, three. Hang on. Let me get my pen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Tall. Oh, man. All right. Um. Man. Well, how many more it needs? There's 48 per row. Let me get my phone real quick. Get to the calculator. And there is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 rows that's completed. So that would be. 48 times 11, 528, plus what's on top. Oh, folks, let me pause this and go do a little bit more, and I'll be right back. One more cut. All right, folks, we are back. I told you I was going to sell these bales before I left, and we're going to do that. Um, you might want to watch out, though. I'm loaded. Whoa, I'm missing my turn. I'm missing my turn. Folks, we have 600 bales on here. And, yes, I've been editing uh, some mods. Mr. Blue Farms. Let's get a closer look here. Mr. Blue Farms. Look at that. <laughs> anyway, that's what 600 bales looks like, folks. We got 12 tall and then uh, that much more. 24 bales right there on top. But we got this full. I don't know how this is going to work when we unload it. But I got six minutes to get this done. And it'll be about 40 minutes video. Now I done tested the trailer to make sure it fit through here, so. But I didn't test it while it was loaded. And there's our other bales. I got all three of them loaded. Figure why not, you know. But I ended up mowing everything I wanted to mow. Before we unload this, I know y'all anxious, but let's go to the map real quick. Let's go down here and turn the grass back on. Sorry, I should have done. Bye. Ah, I should have done had that turned on. And we're going to go to growth. It turned summer and everything turned back ready to harvest. All the grass I mowed, folks, is ready to harvest. Now, I did test this right here. All this here is like on the first state when we uh, first mowed it. So uh, I'm going to try to wait this time until it gets this color. So I'm going to go a day or two in, probably three days in maybe, and uh, see if we can get that to change color because it'll be taller. And I'll show you what I mean here in a little bit. But uh, can I 
Yeah, see, it'll be this tall here instead of half like it was. Yeah, that tallness right there. But anyway, uh, the guy that I got this mod from uh, in his video said that this will not stand up. You have to prop it against something if you want it to stay up. But I watched them and it just goes everywhere, folks. I mean, literally. So I'm afraid it's going to be like an explosion. Because I'm right here next to this building. Uh, let's see. That, that should be the trailer. Let's get my box up here. Uh, unload center. It's not doing that. That's pallets. I wish it'd let me know. It should be that right there. Y is unload. X unload center. It's not moving. So I'm just gonna I'm gonna unload folks. Here we go. Uh, no. No. Work position. Grab them, grab them, grab them. Oh my god, the lag. We're gonna be picking up bales. Oh my god. Some of them sold. I can't move either. Oh my god, it's so laggy. What am I going to do? I was not expecting this. I got to get my truck off the side somehow or another. supposed to be working if I can get them all the ones that fail off the trailer I can get loaded back on and turned around and it's hard to turn around to you folks it's okay I'm gonna back up and turn around that way I have no idea how I'm gonna get all of them I should have known there'd be some kind of conflict. I'm not going to get them off the top of her. Oh my god. Oh no, no, not on the truck. Whew. They're still falling. Oh, I didn't back up far enough. What am I doing? That been six minutes. So it's going to be just a little bit longer. Oh my, oh, they're still falling. Okay. Keep falling off the top. All right, that should be, uh, unload. Oh my god. Might have to get a tractor up here. I want the ones back there to load. I see they gotta hit the ground before they load. Oh man. Hmm. Okay. Well, I gotta get these to fall somehow. Maybe if I do this. Grab this one, and boom. 
I'm gonna grab this in and boom. Oh. Whoa, whoa. Okay. Well, folks, I'll be right back when I get all these picked up so you can see the total price. Be right back. Oh, wrong button. All right, don't mind me, folks. I'm just in here with the cows. Trying to figure out how to get through here. I'm looking for bales. Don't worry. Same episode. I'm looking for lost bales. Any over there? Nope. Um, they went flying everywhere, folks. They went flying everywhere. Um, I'm on. Get through here. There we go. Uh, you can see the tire tracks have been scuffing. Hey, is that one? No, it's grass bales. Uh, the hardest problem, I had two inside the screen tank. Let me speed up my speed here. Um, as you can see, we can go inside the grain tanks. No collision, and that hurt me badly. Uh, show you this and go inside this one. And same on these here. Uh, yeah, they're hard to jump over. As you can see, I'm inside. You just walk through, and voila, see? There's the pipe. There's the other tank. But I jump over in here and make... There's like 10 in here. Oh, I want to have to cycle through. Ah, there we go. But anyway, I, I think I got all of them. And our total price up there is $576,000, folks. $576,000. Yeah. I, I want to go back and do some more for that price. That's better than a crop price. But watch this. Watch this. I checked on the uh, go up. Well, I guess that was straw I was looking at. I thought I was looking at silage. I was going to say it dropped all the way down to 97. There's no price for silage. I don't know why. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> I wiped that baby out. But we still got time. I'm thinking about fast forwarding it for about three days. And going back, just keeping an eye on the grass and uh, see how tall it's going to get. Um, I don't have a good spot here. But I think I'm done here anyway. I, I, those up there that was the hardest to get, really, uh, inside these, that somehow top don't have a collision, but the bottom does, and they, it was hard to get out of there, very hard. But anyway, um, got the tractors here, I think I'm going to wash them up for a bit, I don't know if I'm going to put them away right now, I got to hurry and get off here, and, oh yeah, I got uh, a couple here. And these here are just from, uh, oh yeah, this is what I was going to show you. Right here is where it's been mowed. So that's what it looks like mowed. And this is the first stage. You see it's how nice and clean this grass. It don't have the buds on it. Let me show you some that has the, see this right here, the tips. When it gets the tips on them, that's when it's fully grown. So that's why I say I need to wait a day or two. And you see right here, the different colors. Um, all this is grass, but I can't get these because they're trees. There's nothing but trees. And if I go to soil, you'll see that. Yeah, see? Trees, trees, and trees, and a bunch of trees in here. But there you go. Um, so I'm going to fast forward time. A little bit and get this color here that means that it's fully grown so other than that folks i'm gonna leave y'all with it um what am i gonna buy with this money um i'll probably already bought it by the time y'all answer that but still put it down in the comments i was gonna check and see if this is full yeah, i got one bell over here that's full so uh if I have to feed uh, Betsy one more time, which is getting close, I'm going to have to uh, buy some more straw bales. 
So hopefully the wheat come off before then. But I got some maintenance and stuff to do on. I already done the, the skid steer. It's getting sluggish. I'm going to pull all the pieces of equipment in and get them uh, repaired. And folks, I'm thinking about buying another tractor. I really am. I don't know which one yet. Um, probably going to replace one of these. Replace a small one at least with a bigger one. Not for sure. I'm thinking about buying two tractors and a combine. We need a combine first. Oh, autosave. Um, I gotta get off here. I would then sucked up the time. It's gonna end up being an hour video. But the, we got the Massey here. And folks, I'm thinking about just uh, go ahead and doing that real quick. I'm not for sure. Uh, that's the one we got right there. And I thought about maybe going to a case, but there's one, yeah, right here. That's going to be a lot of money. But this right here would really, they're the same thing. I don't know what the difference is in them. Uh, other than the tops. That's one thing I can see different. We don't want that, and that's the one we had in Corn Belt. Um, this here is a good combine. We might even get uh, go with uh, uh, this here. Um, or maybe a John Deere. It'd save us some money. Because we really need tractors. We need a good combine, but then again, we need a good tractor too. So we might just split the money down the middle. But I do know what I want to do first, and I'm going to do that uh, now, but y'all going to see it at the beginning of the next video. I'm sorry, folks. I hate to do y'all that way, but we need more poop and milk. And uh, I'm going to buy some more animals, but y'all ain't going to see how many I'm going to buy this time. I hate to be that way, but to get y'all to watch my next video. Uh, yeah, come back to see it and you'll see how many cows we got. So, till next time, folks, y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and you've been watching No Creek Farms with Mr. Brew. See y'all.